what is up everybody, Patrick Hogan here today, I am here with another video. Now, today what I'm going to be doing is, I know it's quite early for this, but I'm going to be predicting the FIFA 17 team of the year. Now, I know I haven't done webcam on a face cam in a while. My uh, career mode video is uploading right now, so hopefully that turns out well. But today I'm going to be showing you my prediction on the FIFA 17 team of the year. So in goal, we obviously have Czech. Now, as a Barcelona fan, or a Barcelona fan, Barcelona and Arsenal, I love Czech. He was one of the best goalkeeper signings in the BPL to another BPL team I think I've ever seen. 93, I believe that is the second highest rated goalkeeper in the BPL that's ever been on the game. I, because De Gea was... Uh, yeah, De Gea is 94. The, he's just been out of this world for Arsenal. And he got the record breaker for most clean sheets in the BPL. I mean, is it your job to keep goals out and to get clean sheets? That makes him one of the best in the business, especially in the BPL. Now, for uh, the center back. And obviously, you have a pretty lit defense. And the reason why I didn't put in Neuer is that Neuer has been team of the year every single year. I want something different, and I think you guys want something too. We have the three highest rated defenders. Godin is, like, for me, a must in this next team of the year. Thiago Silva gets in every year. His stats show you why, but... I'm looking at that 86 pace on Sergio Ramos. I think behind uh, Marvel win, that is the uh, fastest center back in the game. That is just a filthy card. 95 defending, 90 physical. Every single person uh, in the defense has over 95 defending, and every single person has over 80, not 89 physical at least. But all of them have over 70 pace, so those three center backs are filth. Absolute filth. And as you can see, two of the most filthy midfielders probably in the game. It is Paul Pogba and Yaya Torre. My two, my, Pogba is my favorite player to use on this game. But them two are absolutely amazing. I just can't say anything. I already have three team of the years in this team. That shows me, that shows you guys that I think that these players perform at a decent rate the whole time. Uh, but next is going to be, I want Gareth Bale and Cristiano Ronaldo to be my left mid and right mid. Bale is just, I have no words. He is just so good. His stats scream, G get me, I, yes. Like, he's literally the best player in the game. And he's better than Pogba. Look, look at his defending, it's 75. Whole, I did not realize he was that good of a player. Ronaldo on the other side is absolute just sheer brilliance just Ronaldo is I don't want to start anything but I think he is joint best player in the world Bale is certainly up there if you guys agree down in the comment section vote Bale I think Bale is absolutely amazing and now on to the front three Ooh, I'm excited that is a front freaking three. The reason why I didn't use the 98 Ebra is because there will be no 98 PSG Ibrahimovic in the next game. There will only be the Manchester United. I do have the PSG one. I, I wanted to buy him as soon as I could because you know he's, he's going to be extinct. He's not going to have it anymore. So yeah, Messi 99, everybody knows him. Seriously? that gardener outside. Uh, Neymar, my favorite player, and I have the Ibrahimovic jersey. I got this in remembrance to him because he's not playing for Sweden anymore, which sucks because that Joe against Joe Hart, I'm pretty sure everybody wants him back. So, uh, yeah, and then, uh, yeah, so that's the front three. I personally like Bale to be as far up front as possible. So far up front that you can't you can't see him on the screen. Yeah, yeah, you can. 
But uh, yeah, guys, so if you guys like this squad builder, please leave a like and subscribe. The support always helps, and uh, yeah, so bye-bye.